that dream job finally awaits you if you possess some pretty unique and bloodthirsty skills. According to the city's website, you've got to have a swashbuckling attitude, a crafty humor, and full disclosure, rats will hate the job. If you've got a killer instinct to advance the city's efforts in getting rid of rats, then the director of rodent mitigation may be a job for you. According to the new job post listed under the Office of Deputy Mayor for Operations, a background in urban planning, project management, and government is a plus. And most importantly, a drive and determination to fight the city's, quote, real enemy. Mayor Eric Adams recently signed four bills to fight rats and build a cleaner city. The city's rat action plan requires rodent proof bins and buildings designated by the city to have a rat infestation, and it requires large construction projects to have an exterminator on site. Plus, starting next year, trash bags will not be allowed at the curb until 8 p.m. Some New Yorkers are unsure if these measures will rid the city of its relentless rat population. The rat problem is so bad, I don't think it will be any less. Than it has been. The rat problem is it's pretty bad. We I see rats every day. Yeah. Perhaps a director of rodent mitigation is the solution in increasing cleanliness and preventing pestilence. Rats do something to traumatize you and you never live through it. And I hate rats. The director of rodent mitigation will report to the deputy mayor for operations in Mayor Adams' office. Get this, the job pays $120,000 to $170,000.